Chicos, TV here. Ehoy. Um, whatever. Um, hey guys, TV, TV on here, and basically I am practicing this trumpet like you saw in the last video or something. So here's the trumpet itself. Here's the trumpet itself. I gotta go ahead and. And basically, I just gonna go ahead and just lay down and just do some trumpet skills. So today's video, welcome back to day two of TP1 in Espanol. And basically, my grandparents had a trumpet. I told you a lot, guys, in the last video. I might have told you guys. So here is the trumpet itself, so here's the bells, Here, here's the, um, I don't know if this is the tuning slide, this is where you probably empty your water or something, maybe the bell might be also, one of the horn or something, this is where you put your lyre if you're like in pep rallies or something, this is like some extra stuff, I don't know, here are the three keys or valves, like all brass instruments have, and I don't know what the bottom's for, cause I only play, I know how to play alto sax, not trumpet, but I know the difference between alto sax and trumpet. Although they are both commonly brass instruments, but saxophones like mostly read woodwind slash brass. Because of metal. And then the trumpet's also the same thing, but it's all brass. Because of the mouthpiece and stuff, it's pretty small to tell between the inside and the outside of the trumpet. So basically, he played it like a long time ago, probably like since 1960s or something. Not sure, maybe 1950s or something. It's pretty. This is pretty old trumpet. So all I'm gonna do is how I play it is you basically just you said basically to make your lips like this, and make sure I'm mature like this and stuff, and then just. Buzz like this, and make it go into the mouthpiece perfectly, and then that way a note will come out like this. I thought it was come out as but I'm not sure, but my neck will probably be like a little lower. And then just by moving my top part of the lip down lower down the mouthpiece and just buzz. It's like a tuba or trombone or something, or something lower than that. I not really got a trumpet, but I don't know about high note. because I let it go and stuff like this loud. I don't know if I can play it that loud, but I'm gonna try to play as loud as I can because everyone's still sitting, so I don't know if I can do it right now, but I'm gonna try it one more time. A little lower than that, but as the as I can go. Because I want to head around a week yet. I'm going to try playing hot cross bonds or maybe something like that. I don't know if I can play that well, but... 
Something like that, but I don't know. It's like Mary had a little lamb or something. <laughs> to get up. <laughs> that seems kind of hard, but here's the trauma case. It's pretty hard to open. It's really hard for me to open, but I don't know how to open it, but let's show an inside the trumpet and see how long it's going to go. I know I might have gone all over the camera, but I'm just trying to get it a little louder. Oh no, RIP headphone users, please turn your volume down at 558. Just make sure you turn your volume down. But, but also turn your volume down again because I'm going to be doing it again. Turn your volume down right now if you're, if you're, if you're, I have phone. Turn your volume down right now, cause I'm about. Cause it might cause you death. If you want to, I'm not going to do that anymore for the rest of the series, but yeah, it's basically like a trumpet challenge dingy. And my challenge is to play something like Oh to Joy, like with with all five with five notes memorized. So I'm going to practice that and then I'll be right back with you guys in a second. <laughs> I practiced this trumpet for over three days now. So I'm guessing and I wasted all my days practicing just on one instrument. I don't understand what we can do right now. So all I know right now is just a little piece. I don't know. Something like that. So I'm going to do some little bit of practicing on that. So. I'm going to have to see you guys in day three. Peace.